गुड मॉर्निंग माई डियर स्टूडेंट्स नाउ टूडे आई एम गोइंग टू रिवाइज योर सिक्स लेसन ग्रेटिट्यूड आई हैव ऑलरेडी कवर्ड योर हाफ ईयरली पोर्शन दिस इज वन टू सिक्स यू हैव टू प्रिपेयर द लेसन एक्सरसाइजेज क्वेश्चन आंसर एंड एवरी थिंग यू मे राइट द आंसर बाई योर सेल्फ यू कैन फ्रेम योर इंग्लिश एंड यू कैन गिव द आंसर यू आर फ्री बट इफ यू आर नॉट गुड इन इंग्लिश यू हैव टू ट्राई to learn the answers which is given by the teachers now today in this gratitude lesson we must know that we must have love and affection for others we should do the work for others we should think about others we should not go for everything for ourselves like sacrifices everybody is doing sacrifice even the animal or the trees and the plants so we should also learn to sacrifice for them because we are superior than all those things an animal can't think more than you but a dog or a cow you can see they are giving much more they can give whatever they can give they are giving means a dog can give you love he can protect you unconditional love he can it can give and the cow which is um you know everything about cow what the things she can give you so everybody is doing sacrifices you must know that what you can do for others you must educate yourself you must learn something from any other sources from your teacher from your electronic gadgets from the surrounding from your friends from your parents from your school this is the best place to learn that what you can do for the society and how you are delivering your good things to the society you must forgive your bad things whatever the bad habits you are having that forget it and try to good good things for others you have to think about others that some conditions i am giving if you woke up in the morning so you are blessed because millions those who are not blessed they died last night so you are blessed that you wake up in the morning and you can see everything again if you have food to eat you are blessed means many people you can think you can imagine you can go through the news as well that many people are not having food to eat so you are blessed that you can eat anything that you want clothes to wear and a house to live in you have clothes of your choice you may have some other things also some toys also some books also so the all these things which you are having you must feel blessed because millions of people are there those who are not having they are suffering they are struggling you are much better than those who do not possess these so you think about this that you are much more better than those people who are not having these things with them so you should not degrade yourself just you have to manage the things whatever you are having <laughs> and you must have the quality to deliver good from you to others if your parents are there to take care of you you are very fortunate means you are having someone to take care of you your parents your friends and some if your relatives are there you are very much fortunate means you are having good time that you are having these people around you to take care of you if you can hold someone's hand hug him or even touch him on the shoulders you are blessed because you have a friend this is very clear that if you have friend in the society you must have some qualities then only you will have some friends and you should think about this that if you are having friends then you are blessed if you can read this message you are more blessed than over 2 million people in the world that can't read and write if you can read if you are able to write anything you are more blessed than those people those who are not having the capability to read or write this is the main thing that we should think about this that whatever we are having we have to manage it we are not thinking about this and we are dreaming for those items which we are not having 
if you want to gain something more you have to work hard for that showing gratitude appreciation and thankfulness is a positive attitude for the acknowledgement of the benefit that one has received or will receive you must show gratitude gratitude means you should say thanks you should show love to others and you should be grateful that if somebody is giving something to you so this kind of gratitude you must have appreciation this is the second thing you must say good words to others means if somebody is doing something for you you should show your gratefulness you should say thanks you should say good about that thing or thankfulness means you should feel that somebody has done something for you bad attitude will never be appreciated means if we are not behaving properly if our behavior is harsh if we are not talking properly with other people definitely nobody will like you in future so remove all these kind of attitudes you should think about others and you should say thanks sorry for your mistakes to others people who experience gratitude are happier means if you will say someone good words then definitely he will be happy by listening your words so he will do good again for others if we will say bad things to any other person then definitely he will not do good for other persons also so we have stopped those people we should say always good things to others more helpful for forgiving you must be more helpful you should be ready for those people those who are doing good for you and you must be forgiving if somebody has done some mistakes with you then you should forgive him you should not remain uh, the things in your mind you should not keep it in your mind you should the uh, build the habit to forgive the things gratitude provides you the abundance of happiness that you desire and deserve in life means gratitude will give you the abundance of happiness so many things are, are present around you that will give you happiness and you will be more happier than others if you will focus on small small things if you will focus on big things that you will purchase 10 lakhs rupees of car then definitely you have to work hard then you will manage the money then you will purchase car then you will be happy so this is not this is wrong daily by daily you have certain good things around you that you have to think about this and you must work on it means if you have the habit of plantation go for it daily you can at least give water to the plants then if you have uh, animals at your home then you can feed them you can just take them for walking so whatever the things you have you can manage for your happiness our basic attitude of life is one of claiming rights and shunning responsibilities we are claiming rights that we can go that side we can talk we can purchase i want this i want that we know everything but we don't know what we have to do we are never thinking about this that what are our moral responsibilities what we should do for the society and what we should do for the other peoples as well we have seeked to appreciate the blessing of life such as health means if you have good health you are blessed the beauty of nature if you are in a beauty of nature you are uh, going through the park you can see the animals you are blessed human relationships love and respond to them with gratitude everything around you like park animals human relations you must pay love and attention to those those who are present around you gratitude is the key to happiness this we have to remember if we are having love in our heart definitely other people will show love for you then we feel that life owes us the fulfillment of every desire 
and if we do not receive this we feel bitter and envious means we are just showing our uh, nature that everything we will get that from where you will get you have to sacrifice for that you have to give time you have to give love to others then only you will get the things why should be thankful this you have to think that if you are thinking we should say thanks we should say this word and that word to others then why you should be thankful because whatever the behavior you will do with others the same thing you will get back if you will say thanks you will say sorry to others definitely other people will say thanks and say sorry to you so if you are giving respect other people will give you respect gratitude allows you to make you aware of the good things that are happening in your life means gratitude is always will give you the happiness that is happening in your life so this is the only behavior that we are inculcating we are changing according to the situation we can find negatives in everything also and uh, we can find positive in everything also so we have to inculcate the habit to find the positive things in everything in small small things then only we will be happy gratefulness is the key to a happy life that we hold in our hands means gratitude is the only key that will give you the happiness if we are not grateful then no matter how much we have we will not be happy because we will always want to have something else or something more so if we are not understanding the things we are not having gratitude in our heart then always we will be suffering and we will think about those items those things which we are not having now gratitude is the good quality which springs from the soul it will come from inside you it will be uh, it will not be taught by any other person if i will tell you that you must have love in your heart and you should go do good uh, good for the other persons also then it should be coming from your heart you should think that i have to do good then only it will be performed appreciation can bring major change in your life it means if you are appreciated by other persons if you are appreciating to other persons that definitely it will change you and it will change others also this will give the uh, confidence to do good for others persons what if god decide to stop blessing us now the last point in this class that you have to think that god has given so many things god has given park animals waterfall rivers mountains cool wind airs and good atmosphere and environment and finally your parents also so everything around you and the parent which you are having that they are also taking care of you they are giving love and proper care to you you should think that if god stops giving you all these things then how will be the life so if god is giving to us we should give it to others also we should just pass it to others also we should do good for others also thank you